It's the last day of season two, everybody. We just had the major event yesterday. Unfortunately, I missed it. I was all ready to go. I was gonna live stream it and everything. And my internet went down at about an hour before the event. What are the chances of that? My internet barely ever goes down because I live in a suburb outside of a big city. But yeah, it was down for two hours yesterday. I completely missed the event. I had to live stream it on someone else's channel after. But that's okay. Uh, at least they uh, didn't give out free skins. I would have been uh, bummed out about that. I was thinking they were going to give out uh, either the Engineer or Agent Jonesy skin, but they didn't either. So, in a twisted way, that worked out good for me. So here's the agency post the event. It's been destroyed, pretty much. And I believe that the Shadow Faction is now large and in charge. So we're going to descend upon it. As you can see, I have the Stormtrooper skin. And I was using Kylo Ren's glider. I'm not sure why I got Kylo Ren's glider. I think it might have been a giveaway for the Star Wars event. Alright, so we're going to smash through here. And we have about a day left to play around with this map before Season 3 kicks in. Um, maybe take note of where everything is. I like this half of the agency because there's a lot of chests and it's easy to maneuver undetected. You're going to run into a lot of players coming here. Everyone's coming here to try and see what the agency looks like after the event. So let's go over here and shield up. I like this little room here. You can shield up and destroy the generator, taking down all the laser cameras. Alright. Yeah, not only did I miss the event, but I had to wait about an hour before I could even get on the play and see what everything looked like. But that's okay. I'm not going to cry over spilt milk. It is just a video game after all. Got something cool in the mail yesterday. Um, I still have the Wii U hooked up in the other room. So I've been getting games here and there. I got Tekken Tag Tournament, and I fired that up last night. That was good times. I was trying to remember how all those guys' special moves went down. Alright, here we go. Oh, look at that. That's the center of the agency, my friends. It's just a big pool of water with steam rising out of it. Right, let's go up the vents here. This is probably the best way to walk around undetected. This place is crawling with opponents and henchmen. And I do not have a disguise on. There we go. We got the henchman disguise on. So we can walk around a little bit more uh, safe, shall we say. So let's go see... Oh, there's my buddy. That means, what did you do last night? He didn't respond. Alright, back to the vents. We don't want to go there. We just explored there. Let's go up here and open a chest if we can. Since we have the Shadow Henchman disguise. I look forward to uh, playing today, the last day of the season. So you can see I'm only level 271. I am not anticipating that I'm gonna hit 300 like I was hoping. I did all my challenges, I got all the XP coins. There's really nothing left to majorly boost me up there. And since I work a day job and I'm a full-time parent, I don't really have as much time to play Fortnite during the week as the weekends. Alright, so let's see what's in this chest. I can't believe I haven't run into another opponent. I just played a whole bunch of games, and as soon as I landed, I was in a confrontation immediately. And there's so many people here, you could be shooting two people, and then a third or fourth guy will come in and just eliminate you. So, be careful when you land here. 
I recommend hitting the Christmas house first. Or that little shack. Getting some loot and then coming here. Or at the very least, put a disguise on when you land. Alright. Where is Shadow Midas hanging out? I want you guys to see what he... Oh, there he is. I may not have actually seen him when I was playing this match. Because I, I did play this match yesterday after the event. This is the next morning. Since it takes me about 10 games to get a good game here. <laughs> I don't want you guys to have to sit through all the times I was eliminated. A couple times I would land and I was eliminated immediately. In a couple games, uh, you could actually get the sniper rifle. There he is. Shadow Midas, knocked down. Sir, you are no longer in charge here. Let's throw him somewhere safe so we can shake him down without any interruption. There he is, Shadow Midas. That's cool, huh? Alright, let's take his drum gun. Let's see if I can get to the vault without getting eliminated. As I said, there's a lot of players coming here. They all want to see what happened to the agency. So step carefully, my friends. Let's get rid of these urinals. You know, I've never seen a henchman in here. It's kind of like Five Nights at Freddy's. Everyone always wonders, when, when does that security guard go to the bathroom in those six hours he's working there? Even the animatronics have asked that question. Alright, let's see if we can get a disguise going again. And make our way over to the vault. Yeah, I gotta get down the schematics of this new configuration of the agency. Now that a lot of stuff is missing. I know that you could just drop down into the pool of water. And the basement is on one side, not this side. Look at this. This place has been demolished. Although, uh... Was it bad or was it good? It seemed like Midas was trying to save everyone from the storm. So maybe he's the hero. Or maybe he's the anti-hero. Like Stone Cold Steve Austin. I prefer The Rock though. Back when The Rock and Stone Cold were fighting. I was always into The Rock more. I smelled when he was cooking. Let's get this one. It's good to see some of the chests are still where I think they are. We are, we're really bad already here. We got Midas drum gun. Got 170. Gonna combine the health and shield. All right, let's do this now. Scanning. Oh, look at that. It's like a trade up to a gold assault rifle. Everything Midas touched really is gold, isn't it? In my last, one of my last videos, I had referenced a song from the 90s, and I was incorrect. It's actually from the 80s, the Midas Touch. I cannot remember the name of the band, but boy, was that a great song to dance to. Who remembers the James Bond movies? This whole season reminds me of a, a great James Bond movie. I grew up with those, with Sean Connery and Roger Moore. I remember Goldfinger. Boy, was that a great theme song. I'm not going to sing it because I don't want to get a copyright claim on this video. But I, I love that song. And I love singing it. And I think it would sound great in a baritone. I always have a first thing in the morning baritone voice. Baritone. Let's open the vault. Sounds like a... A nice jazz club vocal. Early morning vocal. Throw a little vibrato on. 
And then I'm gone. I feel like I'm at McKelly's in Hollywood. That great Italian restaurant where they have the lounge singers. That's a great place. You ever visit Hollywood? Go to McKelly's or Musso and Frank's. Get the old world Hollywood experience. I don't know if the Egyptian is still open, but they used to have movies there when I was a teenager in, in my 20s. That was a cool place. The Egyptian. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. I'm going to put myself to sleep with all that lounge singing. There's a reason why they call it lounge. Because you just want to lounge out when you're listening to it. Hey, I just went down to Musso and Frank's and got a pie. It's a delicioso. How's the stormtrooper eating that without taking his helmet off? He's pulling some uh, Mandalorian bits there and leaving the helmet on. Because everyone's watching, so he can't take it off. Alright, so we've successfully landed at the agency post-event. We actually knocked Shadow Midas, took his drum gun, went to the vault, raided it, and I still have yet to run into an opponent. So this is a little piece of movie magic here. I'm surprised I haven't run into an opponent yet. Because everyone and their brother is landing here. You'll see. Look at that. It's just a wall of water. The storm is coming, my friends. The storm is coming. That there looks like a tsunami wave. My buddy was tsunami wave from WMAC Masters. What a fantastic gentleman that was. Martial arts master, supreme. Just all around great guy. My childhood bro. He even did my paper out for me when I was sick. Just a great man. Alright, I think we're gonna leave the agency. I think we got a grandioso tour. Look at that wall of water. That thing's just waiting to drop. That's quite something else. Alright, I'm gonna go to Salty Springs and see if I can't tackle that root drop. I hope you like the tour of the agency post-event. I'm so sorry that I couldn't live stream the event for you. But it was a little bit out of my control seeing that Spectrum cable calling you out. You uh, dropped my internet for two hours at the worst time possible. <laughs> Although I'm very thankful that there was no uh, free loot involved with that event, because that would have been very sad. I see a lot of, a lot of big name players couldn't get into the event. That's unfortunate. Big uh, YouTube streamers too couldn't get in. I'm, I'm just a small time rinky dink YouTuber. I'm just doing it for fun. I'm not even monetizing my channel. I may do that at some point if it starts to get crazy with the subscribers. And if I do do that, I will start doing giveaways. So I'd like to share more. Alright, Banana Boy, you're out of the game. And so is your opponent. Oh, Midas Drum Gun. It's a fantastic weapon in a fight. Oh, someone else is shooting at me. Let's see, where are you? Right behind me, building a ramp. Just taking some wild shots. I should get my own ramp going. Oh, it's Sky. Ah, uh, I got taken out of the game before I wanted to. Number 10. Well, my friends, I hope... Oh, look at that. The storm's coming in on Sky. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, I mainly just uh, played the game to show you the agency. The next game, I want to show you a little bit more of the storm. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. And please enjoy the very last day of Season 2. Have a beautiful day, my friends.